Yo, hello, this is Kay Cox, music producer, drummer, and occasional DJ. Welcome to day number 27 of Omni Augusphere. Need you know not? Day 27, We're only three more days to go. Thank you for watching. It's been a really cool journey. It's been a lot of laughs, a lot of fun. 27 days. And if you're new to the channel, hit that like button, subscribe button, and notification bell for new music and tutorials from me. Let's get into it. Omnisphere! Now I'm gonna go to a flute sound. Flute, flute, flute. Actually, desert flutes. Fast Chief Hairborn flute. That sounds a little too EDM for me. I just want a flute sound. Whistling bold kalimba. I just want a flute. Five hours later. This might just have to be a flute today. Okay, let's see here. I want it faster. I might as well duplicate this and then use, delete these, duplicate this. I'm gonna change this to say lead and this is going to be chords. I'm definitely gonna change the key. Change the piano. Let's loop it out. I'm gonna make the key minor. So go from G sharp to G natural, go from D sharp to D natural. Let's hear how it sounds. Let's turn the A sharp down a half still. Make it A natural. Okay, now it's time to add the chords. Take everything that's sharp, put it natural. C sharp, we'll take C sharp, take it up to D. And then A sharp, take down to D sharp. Okay, that don't, that don't sound too too bad, actually. That sounds pretty good. You know, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give some side chain effect. Like, eh, 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 eh. That's too boring. Freeze track, flatten track, and here we are. And I'm going to change this to a piano sound. No burning piano, rose piano, just a basic piano. I get like a classical piano and to get keyscape. Five hours later. Oh, distant piano. I see the classical like Yamaha, nothing crazy. Backwards studio piano. Why does it have to be backwards? Like, let me get just a regular classical piano. Let's take an upper octave. Let's hear how it sounds with this. That sounds good actually, That's, that doesn't sound too crazy. Add some effects on it, I'm gonna add some EQ, some side chain volume automation with the auto pan. Turn it to, remember, turn the amount to 100. Don't have to worry about the shape. Turn the phase to 360, and let's change the waveform. We wanna change the hertz into notes. So it'll be eighth note, half note, sixteen note. No 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 no. I right, bad idea. Let me turn this off. To the frequency sifter, I'm gonna add tape effect. So add like a flutter, add the wow effect, color. That's the loop. That's actually fire. Like you could do a lot with that actually. You have some rain noise just to, just to be extra, add some rain. Let's copy. Let me duplicate freeze flat in this. Duplicate freeze flat, duplicate freeze flat, duplicate freeze flat. That's my favorite thing to do. It's really efficient on your hard drive. I'm going to make a small arrangement. Nothing crazy. Ping pong. Here's the final loop. Check it out. Let me know what you think.
simple and effective. Everything is getting really like calm and ambient. I don't know why, but that's just kind of the mood. I don't know why everything is turning into that. I, I can't explain that. Maybe that's just who I am as a person, just a really calm person. I don't know, but everything is getting really calm. I promise you, next time I'm gonna make some hype. This is loop number 27 out of 30. Thank you for watching. It's K Cox. Like, share, subscribe. Ciao.